to this segment of fear of missing out. Well, as traders, we all have this. So, whether you've been trading for one day, one week, one year, or one decade, it's all in us, it's all amongst us, but we need to know how to manage and diminish that fear of missing out factor. Because most of the time when you're in a fear of missing out factor, you're already at the point where the market's already exhausted itself in either the upside or the downside. And then you hop on at the end when everybody else is taking profits, which will then begin to get the market to start turning around, typically. So, how do we coat the fear of missing out? Well, that begins with a trading plan and your trading strategy. If your trading strategy does not tell you to buy or to sell, then what are you missing out on? What is the fear of missing out? You're not missing out on anything. Your strategy has told you not to buy. So what does that mean? It means you need to sit on your hands and realize that there are more moves that are made in the market than positions you will ever take. Okay? So. <clears throat> With that being said, the good traders and the traders that like to be able to take in profits and become successful are the traders that learn how to manage the fear of missing out. They understand their trading strategy, they trust it, and they will only trade when their trade strategy tells them to trade. Other than that, there should be no fears of missing out because at that point you're gambling. You don't understand where the market is, where it's going, or how it got to where it was because it wasn't part of your plan that you sit down and write down and execute every single day.